Hello, welcome to another vlog. Hope you had a good Christmas. Uh, I'm just looking at the coach now. Uh, not too long till we leave. So um, we've got none eating away today. <laughs> it should be a good game, Derby. Uh, should be a bit of bite to it, especially uh, after the performance the other day. It was shocking. So I'm expecting a reaction from the team today. Uh, we should see. And uh, yeah, I don't know whether I'm going to get any uh, sweets today because uh, everywhere's shook because it's Boxing Day. But uh, we'll definitely have a cup of tea and uh, we'll get a program when we get to the ground and let you know what the team is and what my thoughts are. Uh, we'll see you then. On to the coach. Ground. Uh, had to park in some car park outside, I don't know where it is, but um, I think the bar's open, so I might have to go in there and get some crisps or something. Uh, we'll see you on the inside. Well, I don't know how well you can hear me or how well you can see me because of the sun, but Jesus, it's bright today. Uh, town players are just warming up. Uh, I have no idea what the squad is at the minute. I'll go grab a program. The music in the ground is rather loud, so I hope we, uh, that doesn't get me copyright striped, but we'll, we'll click on again in a minute because of the audio. Okay then. Obviously, Tamworth first in the meeting today. Shit result last week for Tamworth. We're obviously aiming for three points today. If that doesn't happen, mate, we're fucked. Oi, oi, this, oi, oi. this will make my fucking Christmas. If morale's, if morale's still here, by the end of these games, we has got to go. Our opinion. But anyway, up the fucking lads! Final Saturday start with visitors in goal number one, Dan and Jeja. Two, Andy Burns. Three, Steph Morley. Four, Ellis Dini. Five, Luke Jones. Six, Joe Petto. Seven, Callum Powell. Eight, Amin Verma. Nine, Connor Taylor. Ten, Zach Cotterfer. Eleven, Daryl Knight. The substitutes for the visitors, 12, Drew Ricketts. Fourteen, Bradley Reed. Fifteen, Charlie Shaw. 16 Fair Water and 17 Dex Waters. He's offside. Making these look like a fucking top 16 now is ridiculous. Yeah. At least it's not fucking freezing and pissing at Oh, Keeper just edited him. <laughs> put it out. Why is he not put it out? 
<laughs> well, <laughs> what do I say about that? We're just about to kick off the second half. I've been to get a cup of tea, talking to some of the fans, and they're just disgusted. Um, I think 90% of them want Morel out. I don't know um, what he's going to do to change it. It looks like he's making subs at half time. He's brought on uh, Ricketts, I think the centre back's name, Drew Ricketts. He's brought the centre back Drew Ricketts on, and I think um, Dexter Walters is getting on as well. I don't, see, I don't know who's going off, I can't tell. Um, I think, by the looks of it, he's taken off. Wow, what? He's going to three at the back with. No, he can't be because it's around four. I, I can't work it out because <laughs> uh, I can see. I can see Zach Powell. No, uh, no, I think Dex might be coming on in a bit. I think he's just making this defensive change first. So, but yeah, sorry. Second, first half was absolutely diabolical. These are the first team that have been willing to take the game to Tamworth, and Tamworth just folded. So every game I've watched so far, Tamworth had control of the ball, passed it around, and been caught on the counter. None of them have been the first team to actually physically attack us and take the game to us, and they've just tore us to pieces. We don't, we don't like we can handle anything. No pressure. We can't even catch, like, keep the ball for two minutes. So it's gonna, it's gonna be interesting to see what 45 minutes they put out, but. I don't, to be honest, I don't think anything's going to save Andy at this minute. Unless, unless we somehow get like two or three goals out of this second half, then it's going to be very hard to see him in charge after the new year. But um, we shall see the second half. So it looks like Jones gone off as the captain and Ricketts is And number five, Luke Jones, is replaced by number 12, Drew Ricketts. So Drew Ricketts is on. Uh, it looks like we're going, staying four at the back, and Wharton's come on for Deeney in the middle, so Deeney must be carrying the knock. But we need some urgency. Right in the box, unmarked. What a shot! Hey! What a fucking shot cross! Oh no! <laughs> uh, good work by Knights down the wing. Crosses it to Reed, who's in loads of space, but the defender slides and knocks it in. Oh, goal number five, I think. Is there. So I'm having something to shout about. <laughs> Well, what a horrible away day that was. 4-1 uh, final result. Uh, they scored the goal for us with an own goal. I, didn't, I, don't, I don't know if I got it on camera, we'll check in a minute. Um, talking to the fans on the way back, a lot of them are not happy and they, they, they want morale out. Um, it's difficult to say, like, uh, they, Nuneaton had a game plan and they come and they attacked us and pressed and it worked. First half they'd had the game sewn up, there was nothing we could do. Uh, we should a little bit more fight second half after we made changes, but things can't continue you can't concede three four or five that's ten goals in the last uh, three games um, 
and considering we're working on uh, tactics for set plays and defensive plays, it's just not showing on the pitch. Uh, the only other thing I can say is um, they've got a little bit of reaction in the second half from the players, but nothing more. Um, too many players, I think, are trading on Andy Morell's good faith in what their ability is to do, and he needs to change it because there's players that are performing and coming on and doing well that just aren't getting the chances. Um, sorry, I was just watching Matt slow the coach down. Um, yeah, and uh, I think he needs to uh, he needs to play to, like change the team up, just drop drop some players, shake them up because they're just not performing, and they know that in themselves. Like uh, when they come when they come over to get their uh, a little bit of applause at the end of the game, they were just apologising to the fans, and they know they've been awful. Um, the home game is going to be interesting, uh, but we'll see if Morel's still in charge by then. If not, or I'll, I'll give an update video. But other than that, we'll see you in the next one, which is New Year's Day. Thank you very much for watching. <laughs> See ya. Bye.